It's been less than 40 hours since the Supreme Court overturned Roe versus Wade and rallies both for and against that decision really haven't stopped. Good evening. I'm Jared Ahrens. Americans seem either angered or elated right now as the country grapples with the fallout of that landmark ruling. Now, here in San Diego, abortion rights advocates vow to keep fighting. ABC 10 News reporter Madison Weil went to a rally in Escondido tonight where protesters shared personal stories of what abortion rights mean to them. Madison. Dozens of San Diegans gathered outside of Escondido City Hall with signs. This was a very emotional rally. Many shared that even though Californians will still have access to abortion, this was about advocating for equal access nationwide. A crowded street corner in Escondido. Protesters making their message clear. Enough is enough. Garnering support from cars passing by. A mix of emotions were conveyed as protesters took turns giving speeches. I'm angry. I'm scared. And sharing personal experiences. Something I fought for back in the 70s and now they've taken it away. It's, it's just devastating. And their reasons for showing up. Well, I think of my wife, you know, we have a four year old now, but you know, what if she were to have some type of complication during pregnancy? It seems to me that we've allowed our country to go backwards. Organizers shared they plan to continue fighting for abortion rights until they've been restored across the nation. Goal is full legalization, um, nothing less, because we shouldn't have anything less. We deserve bodily autonomy. We're our first world country. <laughs> We asked organizers what's next. They say they're planning to take part in more upcoming rallies and that they're encouraging others around the nation to continue speaking up as well. In Escondido, Madison Weil, ABC 10 News.